What's good, ladies and gentlemen? We're talking to Texas Longhorns at their spring game, and a young man by the name of Manny was the center of attention. Make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel. Again, a lot of the colleges had their spring game on Saturday, and the Texas Longhorns was in the spotlight. Uh, Team White defeated 21-10 to 10 over Team Orange, but that wasn't the big story. The stories were on the quarterbacks. Would it be Peyton Manning's nephew, Arch Manning, or would it be the returning quarterback, Quinn Ewers, who uh, played 10 games last year, and he led the Longhorns pretty much to an 8-5 record? Well, Ewers looked pretty good. His team got the win. Team White, 21-10 over Team Orange. He was 16-23 for 23 for 195 yards and one touchdown, whereas quarterback Arch Manning, he was uh, splitting time with blue chip quarterback Malik Murphy on the Orange team. Uh, Manny looked like a freshman, pretty much his stats line, 5 for 13, 30 yards. Uh, Malik Murphy, another blue chip quarterback, he was 9 for 13, 165 yards and a touchdown. But Texas head coach Steve Sarkeesian killed the quarterback controversy. He has decided to go with returning starter Quinn Ewers as his quarterback this upcoming season. He hasn't released a depth chart, so we don't know if Arch Manning will be number two or number three behind Ewers. But he decided to go with the more most experienced guy, which I think is the right thing to do. Uh, Ewers, he started 10 games last season after transferring to Texas from Ohio State. And he is a Texas kid out of South Lake Carroll. So again, Quinn Ewers, starting quarterback for the Texas Longhorns this upcoming season. But will he be on a short leash? What you guys think? Will we see Arch Manning before the season is up? Drop a comment, like the video, and subscribe to the channel. This has been your sports guy, Kendrick. You all have a good one. We'll see you on the other side. I'm out. Deuces.